Okay, good afternoon. My name is Jesse Selber. Uh, I work at MD Anderson Cancer Center. A thank you to the conference organizers for uh, giving us the opportunity to speak, and thank you for uh, TEI for sponsoring the symposium. Dr. Edelman and I are going to share our uh, experience and some of our thoughts on the role of biologics in abdominal wall reconstruction. Uh, I'm a scientific advisor and consultant for TEI Biosciences. So uh, the title, The Role of Biologics in Abdominal Wall Reconstruction, kind of presupposes that biologics have a role, uh, but not the only role. And I do believe that, as you've heard again and again uh, this morning, cost requires judicious use of the products. I think, as again you've heard uh, all morning, in simple abdominal wall reconstruction, a synthetic mesh may be adequate. Uh, in complex abdominal wall reconstruction, uh, for whom patients are more likely to have complications and in whom they are more serious. Uh, biologic mesh is probably uh, appropriate, and we'll talk about some of the issues connected to that. I want to address some general topics. I'll go very quickly because these have been addressed uh, already today, but mesh versus suture repair, synthetic versus biologic mesh, uh, bridging and soft tissue coverage. I'll make the argument uh, that the material does matter uh, and that the technique matters. So you've seen this slide already about seven times today, but um, it's worth reiterating that we don't do very well in general. 12% uh, uh, of hernia repairs require reoperation, uh, and as Dr. Janice mentioned, the five-year recur recurrence rate after the first reop is 25%, 35% uh, after the second, 40% after the third. So do we always need mesh? I think, again, you've heard uh, this morning many times, yes, we do. Uh, this uh, study has also been shown many times this morning. It's level one data, randomized controlled, and demonstrates uh, vast superiority uh, for mesh to direct suture repair. Uh, if we use component separation, do we still need mesh? That's something, a question that I hear a lot. Uh, this is uh, level three data, but it was out of UAB demonstrating uh, significantly higher hernia repair uh, with the use of components without mesh versus mesh. So I think the answer is we still need mesh even if we relax uh, the abdominal wall fascia.